What's happening people, this video is all about how expensive golf clubs are, how ridiculous the prices are now for a set of clubs. I mean, five, 600 quid just for a driver, maybe three grand for a decent set of new clubs. We think it's ridiculous. So we're gonna go out and look in all the charity shops, try and find a second hand set of clubs for as cheap as possible and see if you can have as much fun and maybe shoot as good scores, paying a fraction of the price from what you would do from one of the big retailers. Let's go see what we can find. Right, so we've got ourselves a little bargain, I think. Yeah, it wasn't bad, was it? Yeah, there's nice, some nice clubs in there, actually. Little regal bag. We've got, I mean, we've got some issues. We don't have any wedges, but I mean, for 20 quid. Nine, eight, six, five, three. We've got a hybrid, a well, five. We've got a 24 degree, a hybrid, 22 yeah. degree. Yeah. Which uh, is 26 a, degree. 22 degrees a bit, both the 22 and the 26 are basically woods. So that's 26. And then that one just says five wood, which we presume is 22-ish. It's a nice putter as well. Yeah, the putter's decent. I like that putter. Nice little. I mean, they're all a bit nicked up and that, but they look pretty good addition. I'm pretty happy. I mean, 20 quid, that's crazy. I mean, 20 quid, I think, was probably the price for just the bag. <laughs> yeah, we got it all But we got it off 20 quid. We're so. happy. So what we're going to do is we're going to play three holes, see how, how well we score with clubs that cost 150th of my set. What? 150th <laughs> of my set. See if I can actually hit it. So is it a five iron? These irons are night tech plus oversized. So they look sort of 20 years old. They're quite friendly. They're massive. Yeah, they are big. Ah! Oh. He's pulled that left. All right, my turn. There you go. Let me take my t-shirt. It's come out. It's come out. Yeah, it's come out. <laughs> So what you got? You got, got a five, five wood? wood hippo. Looks pretty old, but I'm I'm sure. I mean, tell me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure hippo was a really good wood brand. I'm sure oh, they were. I don't know. No, but you go. So what you go up the left with this? Yeah. Go Just on. in between that 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 T basically. Yeah. As described, and then that. He's got like 300 in, so what are you going to go for? Well, this one says great escape wood. Yeah, you need that. So it's priced on. Should we use this? This is the loftiest wood I've ever seen. What is that? What is it? It's 26. Hippo? Yeah. Cool, another hippo. Let's go. Down the middle, into the wind. I'm just leaving the tag on blowing in the wind, because, <laughs> you know, why not? The top. Down the middle. Yes, down the middle, mate. It escaped. It's escaping it's the into water. the water. No. That's it. It's in the no. water. No. <laughs> you escaped. Ah, oh, crying out loud. All right, little five with. Smack this down in the middle, let's get a bit of stretch going. Oh, he's pushed it a bit. Uh, that's okay. It's in the bottom, of the, I'm gonna be chipping out. <laughs> We're both, I'm left and he's right. So. I mean, I, I think I should be able to chip mine out of there. I think you're definitely dropping. I think I might I mean, be wet, yeah. I like it. And is that, <laughs> is that, what? How much per clay? How many clubs have you got? Six, seven, eight, nine. Nine clubs, 20, so they're like. Nine two, and the bag. Two, oh, and a bag, yes. Yeah. So let's say two quid a club. 
two quid for the bag. Two quid versus 350 quid. Ooh. Well, 350 quid for what? For a five wood. Oh, yeah, yeah. So like one of these versus that. Is that 200 times better? No. No, so I'm, I'm in here apparently. Is it all a con? Is it all a con? Well, it doesn't look like it for me. Apparently I need my clubs to play like a beast. My ball's there. <laughs> Can you see it? <laughs> oh yeah, it's just against the uh, water safety information sign. Well, I mean, I can't hit it unless I... I left-handed yesterday. Did you're you? Going, you're going left-handed with a little nine iron here. Um, a left-handed shot. See what you can do. It's out. It's out. Good shot, mate. Thanks, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Right. That's a great strike. Lovely flight. Middle of the green. Apparently they do work. Right, so, against the bushes. Hey, I, I like these irons. So, tech plus night oversize. They're, they're quite looking, small on the bottom. They look mental down on the floor though. The, the top line is massive. That is really thick. Put it, put it down the floor. And there is actually quite a lot of offset. They look like they, they look, look like helpful irons. They, they feel short. We'll have to have a check of that in a minute. But they are definitely helpful irons. They're obviously cavity back, thick. Yeah. From like 20 years ago or something, I assume. <laughs> it's out. <laughs> All right, a little chip onto the green then. Nine iron, yeah? Yeah, a little nine. Not, so yeah, no wedges. So this is the lowest, or the highest club we've got is a nine. Easy, this. Doesn't end up in that bunker at all. Uh-oh. Oh, he's bouncing the bunker and come out, the jammy swine. I don't think, I think that's right at the bunker. Yeah, that's why I say it's come out. I mean, I think it landed right nah. in the bunker. Nah, nah. What are we talking about, mate? Nah. What we haven't spoke about, is that bag. We did money, briefly mention it. For the money, that's a nice bag. It's a nice bag. The proper leather, cut, well, part leather, part fabric cart bag. I'd say it's not quite boisterous enough for me. I mean. It needs like a flare for of neon For most orange. people, that is. It needs a flare of neon a orange. A bit garish. <laughs> so was it a lovely just to there with an iron iron? <laughs> yeah, and somebody else has hit an all right shot with a nine. Yeah, I was in there. Chip, you went over a bunker. You've said a full nine. Easy, really. Easy. Oh, is it? Um, oh, do you, do you want to put from there, do you? I don't know. I'm going to have to, I think. I think you should. It's quite bare there, to be fair, isn't it? It is quite bare there. Where? Right, putter is a Ben Sayer Blackjack 2. Is it Ben Sayer, is it? Yeah. The grip it's not Ben has... Hogan. No, it's Ben Sayer. Ben Sayer, is it? Yeah. <laughs> why, do I, why do I want to say it's... I don't know. But yeah. the grip has seen better days. Yeah, it's a bit cracked. But. <laughs> oh, if that went in, I'd it have It worked screamed. pretty well, didn't it? If that had gone in, I would have screamed. <laughs> it does work pretty well, so. I don't know, it might work all right. See, shall we? Grip's not the best, you'd probably want to re-grip it, but it does work. And I would say is, it feels fine. Feels fine, yeah, yeah. It yeah. obviously doesn't feel as soft as like a micro hinged Odyssey or a 500 pound Scotty. Oh, we're not. <laughs> I mean, that Scotty is worth more than all these probably were brand new. Yeah, that's true. But however, how many strokes is that actually going to save you? Does it stop you getting out there and playing? Well, I just got five there. It's pretty and decent. that's with my drop shot. Wait. Pretty decent. I, I don't think there's- No, I've got six. I don't think, so far, We've hit a club that we'd be like, I can't hit that on the course. No. I was expecting these for the price to be Horrendous. awful. Yeah, I wasn't I wasn't expecting to play any kind of golf shot and that nine was the kind of um 
the shot I needed to, to make me feel a bit more comfortable. Yeah, struck it nicely. All right, second hole that we're going to play then. All right, another five wood. Usually, another five wood again, yeah. Definitely a driver here, usually. Yeah, for some people it is. <sighs> <laughs> He did as well. It's lovely down the middle. Good shot. Too much or? Bunker. It's in the bunker, isn't it? Don't look quite unlucky with this. Oh, nice. A bit further left than you might want. It's fine. I mean, they feel hard but they don't feel like they were two quid no i could definitely like, i would say they feel better than what you'd get from sports direct brand new yeah like a phaser or yeah something like the that. cheaper sets the maybe Slatinger. anyway I, I think they feel better than a slashinger club definitely yeah true two quid mate <laughs> two, quid. two quid a club <laughs> and two quid for the bag that will record it 175 i don't know all I don't, 75 yards. I don't think I risk a six out I of there. I think it's a hybrid. You think it's a hybrid out or of the bunker? Short. What? The hybrid will go short. I'm going short. Are you hitting? Seven. Eight. We haven't got a seven. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we need a seven, a wedge. That's all we need, really, for that set. Maybe a driver. This is a funky shot. Yep. We stinned it, which might make it all the way there. It might, it might make it, oh, it's bouncing to the bunker. Oh, do not go in that bunker. Don't go in that bunker. It's stopped, he is, he is a very lucky boy. Because <laughs> we do not have a 60 degree wedge or a nope. 56 or a 54. I'd have been begging, for, <laughs> I'd have been begging for help out of there. Let's strike them perfect. You haven't been having issues with your own clubs recently either. No, no. no. Lockdown as well, I think has helped my game. Oh, really? Yeah, I think not playing constantly, pretty much for a year, with little sporadic intervals, has made me such a better player. So it hasn't you, harmed me at all. Right, let's see Mr. Not Angry chip an iron onto here. Are you yeah, nine in it? Little nine iron chip. You're not bumping running an eight? No, no. So you're land this front of the green, just, just in front of the green. Okay. It's big. Didn't grab. Landed it where I wanted to. Slightly harder one. Luke, over a bunker. It's a good shot, that. I wanted to go a bit left, but I towed it. Bit of finesse there. I, I got that right out of the toe. Ah, right. My fault. Your fault. It's, it's gone all right. The clubs are decent. Yeah, helpful, isn't it? Yeah. Friendly club. This for par. It's a long putt, isn't it? This is a long putt. You look miles away. I am miles away. I reckon this is 250 foot. Yeah, I thought that turned a lot. I'm not very good at it, but <laughs> it feels. Oh no! It feels like oh, oh it's got the skills as well. Good, it? The um, it feels a bit tingy. Tingy, is that yeah. their technical term? I think maybe we're just a bit spoiled with the uh, with the clubs we've got. It's a bit tingy. Because I mean, what we're comparing here really is our clubs, and this is so. This is my set Ooh, with this, my putter in it. This is my yeah, my set. So I got my Scotty, got T100. By the way, don't 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 judge him for not having his, his blue, beautiful Scotty in a cover. He's just a blaspheming fool. So don't stare at me behind <laughs> the camera. <laughs> comparing to those clubs is is a little unfair because we are, like we said, 200 and something times the price. But if you were comparing these to your p little package sets for 500, 600 quid or whatever, I don't think there's that, there's not a huge difference, is there so far? Uh, no, no. I mean, they feel, they don't feel as nice. Yeah, they don't feel as nice as your Mizuno. No, no, this, this is what I'm saying. They don't, they don't feel as like nice. It doesn't feel quite as nice, but the outcome still being the same. Yeah. It's a consistent club for you, although it's 
quite short. It's but, not particularly big. I mean, if I had that in a three wood and it was going another 15 yards, I wouldn't wouldn't be bothered. Because I mean, we're aiming there every time. I, I'm normally in a three wood or a driver on it, and I'm there. So yeah, I'm quite. I've got I've got to the corner. I'm happy. Yeah, you're not wrong. And that was not a good strike. No, I can see that. I like that. Oh, he's going to bang this straight over the corner, I reckon. I'm not. And the middle, nice low one. That should be quite big. Again, we'll sort her off. Nice, mate. Yeah, it was all right, that. Flew me, that. Well, you know. Big Some boy, Some would hit it. What? That was a long walk, that. That's, I'm happy with it. A long walk from it's that a It's a five, isn't it? This is a par five, yeah. Par five, we've made the corner. I'm going to go for this, which we haven't hit yet, I don't think. So this is a Escape 2G Ben Ross stroke save. I've hit that one. Oh, he's banged it. That's a, such a nice strike. It's even better than the five wood for him. Bounce left. Lovely. That's, that is a, that felt lovely. No, I'm going to be, it's just another one of those. That felt no different to my Titleist TS, whatever it is. Brilliant. Two. Yeah. So tight this don't watch it, mate. You'll never get a sponsor from them now. They felt no different. And that's because I'm not. You might a get a sponsor handicap. from Hippo or Ben Ross or whatever <laughs> it is, but. But I'm not a scratch handicap, and that's the point in it. For us normal people, that honestly felt no not? different. I'm near it. Oh, right. Okay. Two and a half now, is it? I don't know. Should, Should, I, try? Should I try and hit the three, three iron? Yeah, go on then. Feels rude, doesn't it? A little three iron off the deck. Jesus. Christ. Rude. Three iron. Green's all the way around there. It's quite a long way away, but. Man, this size, you can get there. Ah, oh, pulled it into the water. That's in the water. Felt nice though. That was that felt the nicest <laughs> out of the lot, and it's a three iron. Eight iron then. Right, eight iron, 141 yards. I think we're not, playing, we're not playing proper golf, I'm just dropping for fun, all right? Yeah, yeah. So I should just drop it. Throw it up a, bit, a little bit as so you get yourself a shot in. I was just throwing it there because we're not scoring a game, we just want to see what the clubs are like. I'm in a bit fat, but it looks good. Little draw on it, on the green. Rolled off the back. I don't, I, that's massive. Maybe it landed on the front as well. No spin. No spin. Is that you or the club? That's the question. I mean, we know it's me because I don't get spin off anything, so. <laughs> See that nice? It's a bit bigger than I think he expected it to be. It's on the green. It's off the green. That flew though, didn't it? Yeah. Hit exactly the, exactly the same shot I did, really, wasn't it? Yeah. It's one club less because I'm bigger. What? What? This one's my one. It was in line with the flag, wasn't it? Uh, I mean, they're both in line with the flag in some way. Yeah. Oh, yeah, to be fair, that one is if you were in them woods. He's been such a, been such a nonce, I don't understand why. Massive. Short. Oh, crap. Unlucky. Bad, ain't it? It's terrible. Unlucky. That's straight. Straight as an arrow. I'll show you how to do it. A couple of feet short. Let me show you how to do it. Really unlucky that. Really unlucky. Let's see what see what this boy's got, shall we? Yeah, that's much better actually. Right and much shorter. That is much yeah, better. You're not wrong, it is much better. Yeah, so much better. <laughs> I've got an easier line in from there, haven't I? Yeah, yeah. Show us the skills of the putter. Can I have that, mate? Lovely. Don't expect any less from you. Oh, he's finishing it off just to prove that he can't. There you go. Wow. This is what it's become, is it? This is what it's become. Last hole. <laughs> Oh dear. Can I have that, mate, if you want? 
Don't need your sympathy, mate. Don't need it. Good. So, overall, you're you're over the moon with those, aren't you? you I love think. Them. I, I, I can't reckon you're going to turn up to the next game with them. Well, I'll be honest. I I am a little bit of a snob when it comes to buying <laughs> oh, things. Oh, yeah. I like expensive, nice looking things. And I thought, 20 quid, we weren't gonna get anything. Anything near that. I thought we'd be paying 40, 50 quid and we'd have absolute crap. They've played really well. They have played uh, remarkably well, the considering woods, the their woods price. have shocked me. The woods the and woods. the hybrid have absolutely shocked me because... They're nice looking, they look nice behind the ball. Hippo's a good brand, they were, so the people that didn't use to play, I'm sure they were a really good wood brand. They've looked good down by the ball, the grips on them are perfect. Literally not a blemish. Yeah. And they play lovely and they hit lovely, don't they? They do hit nice, when, when you catch them anyway. The I, Ross, I like this, um, particularly I'm, I'm a fan of the V on the bottom of that. Stop me digging in and getting through. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I think they're good. The, the irons were I'm forgiving okay. enough. They were okay. I mean, I'm used to the forgiveness of these, which is nothing. So I was quite happy with them. Yeah, see, I'm used to a bit more and a bit more distance. So for me, they're a bit of a compromise, but I could play with them if I had to. I mean, 20 quid. And the bag, decent. Do we have a look in it? Was there? Was there's, there's a lot of pockets to that bag. There's nothing in it apart from my drinks, but. What about these balls? What balls? I did not see those balls. <laughs> Is the drink yours? Yeah, the drinks are mine. Yeah, yeah. but there's, yeah, there's like 20 balls in there. I did not see those balls. <laughs> Strixons. Yeah, there's all sorts in there. Right, full um, tailor made. Is there any ping balls in there? They might be worth it. They might be, yeah. I'll look through. <laughs> but yeah, everything else is. Oh, there's them. a wallet in there. There's a wallet in that one. <laughs> yeah, no, that's. I mean, the bag's decent, the club's decent. 20 quid, you can't say golf's too expensive to go and play. When well, you can book around for 10 quid, you can pick up them, which you can use 200, 300, 400 times. They cost you 20 quid. I, it's not too expensive, is it? Nah. <laughs>